Hello and welcome back all my Dragon Ball theorists. If you haven't watched Super Dragon Ball Heroes episode 13 yet, you have missed out on some of the best animated fighting action. The fight scenes in this episode rival some of the best action we have seen in Super as far as animation goes. So talk about a pleasant and shocking surprise when I watched this episode for the first time. I actually had some jaw dropping moments and there was no story this episode, just fighting and great animation. So for an 8 minute promotional anime, this woke me up this morning with how hype it was. This episode did everything up and showcased Goku going into Super Saiyan Blue and the full capabilities of that form against a powerful enemy like Hearts. I really enjoyed as the fight started to heat up this technique here where Hearts stops Goku's energy blast then punches it back at him. This is the type of fluid fighting and abilities we like to see. Every moment of the fight was crisp with the animation looking stunning. As Goku is pushed back by this attack from Hearts, how he recovers using the building to grip onto was a fantastic use of the landscape in this battle. Then the action breaks for only a moment where Goku asks Hearts, you aren't even serious yet, are you? The music drops and what follows is the type of animation we want to see when the anime does indeed come back. Destruction of all the landscape around Goku happens as he is jumping on debris and avoiding these energy cubes that function like heat-seeking missiles. The battle tactics used in this fight as they counter each other was impressive and visually stunning. Hearts launches a large energy blast at Goku which he catches and flips back around at him buying Goku time to push him back gaining the upper hand to kick Hearts straight up in the air into an epic beam blast where Hearts responded head on with his own. I just felt like this is some of the type of fighting we lost in a lot of the action in Super that we had in DBZ and this fight had a lot of oh wow moments. Of course Hearts was fine as who knows how much power he really does have when he gets completely serious. He dusts himself off and uses his incredible gravity abilities against Goku which it was nice to see Super Saiyan Blue resist it when he powered up but in the end Hearts Gravity Fist did win in this encounter. Then he shows off more of his power as the episode ends and we will have to wait to see what develops in the next episode. I watched this several times already and compared to episode 12 where I didn't even make a video on it because of how lackluster it was, this gave me the Dragon Ball anime fix that a lot of us all need. Even the other fights were full of action and didn't slow the pace of the episode down where Android 17 shields Piccolo allowing him to charge a special beam cannon to put a hole into Kami Oren. As a fan with not much to talk about lately, this episode delivered even though it's only a promotion. With that said, I hope everyone is having an amazing week. Just wanted to make a quick video today before work because this Super Dragon Ball Heroes episode caught a lot of the community off guard with how good the fight scenes are in it. I actually also am enjoying the overall idea of the storyline and want to see what happens with the Universal Seed. Any storyline that threatens the God Hierarchy is a story that I want explored and hope we do get to see in Super when it does return. Until then, we have the next chapter of the manga coming where we will see what Moro's third wish is and hope in the next coming weeks we have something official to go off of for the next movie and Super's return. Thanks everyone for watching, enjoy the rest of your week and let me know what you like most about this episode of Super Dragon Ball Heroes. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to share it and smash that like button. And please subscribe and turn on that notification bell to keep those theories coming.